Hi, I am Maite and you're watching Buzz. El mejor sexo es el que no tiene condiciones, solo te desestresas y listo. Y para eso es el juego de las llaves. ¿Tú, Valentín, jugarías a eso? ¿Estás segura de que no te pondrías celosa con una de tus amigas? Ya te liberaste. Creo que es momento de empezar a descubrir quién realmente eres tú y de ver qué es lo que te gusta. ¿Por qué no te vienes para acá? Y te voy a morder. Hey, so how has Adriana's life changed since season one of Game of Keys? A lot. <laughs> Her life has changed a lot because she She took some decisions that has some consequences and now she's leaving them. She has to go into this new path where she is finding herself again. But I think that she was very brave to be honest with herself. Do you think her life and the other cast members' lives would have been different had they not played the game of keys? Yes, of course. I think that the game changed our lives, our way of thinking, and um, all of the couples Um, have to to go through different process because at the end the same circumstance is not the same uh, situation for all of us you know it's like you can leave something and uh, learn something that I didn't learn and I can leave the same situation and feel it different so yes I think the game changed the life of all of us but in different ways And Game of Keys refers to a game played at a swingers party, but this game crossed over into their daily life, their relationship, their friendship. So is it a game anymore? Um, yes, well, I think that the game is um, the main topic of the story and the players are the ones that are going to suffer the consequences. But at the same time, I think that um, it's something necessary, you know, because you will find yourself and you will notice uh, what's going on with you. And you are going to question yourself if you are being who you really are, or if you are, you are being the consequence of what society told you you have to be. Well, for those who haven't seen the show, can you describe a little bit about Game of Keys and what they can expect from season two? Yeah, Game of Keys is a, it's a game where Couples change um, couples, it's swingers. It's, it's becoming into the swingers world, you know? So um, there's where you are going to start playing and understanding what's going on with all the stories and all the couples that are being part of the game of this. And you are also an incredibly talented singer. So what's the latest with your music at the moment? Well, um, I decided to stop doing my music. So the last three or four years I haven't um, been um, in the music industry because I decided to focus myself in my acting career. So what I do sometimes is um, RBD. It's like sometimes we do an activity or something for our fans and we do it together because we were a pop band, a group, and we have a lot of things to do together and that's cool, but it's not our plan and it's not what we are doing day by day like in my day by day i am just putting all my energy in my acting career so my music is something that i appreciate i love i enjoy but it's it's been a while that i decided to stop doing it well you're incredibly talented in so many ways And I loved, I got to watch a little bit of the second season and I loved it from the opening scene. It's quite, uh, you know, gets you straight away. <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much. And thanks for having the time to watch it. Mama. No voy. Y no voy a regresar, eh. No vayamos a llorar por ti. ¿Cómo terminará esto? Saciarán sus ansias. Hola. Contraseña. Esta es mi contraseña. <risa>